Okay, so we've got question number three here. Um, we've got uh, coordinate axes with a shape B here. And it asks us to translate the shape by 4, 1. Well, we know this 4 means is the horizontal component, and the number at the bottom, the minus 1, is the vertical component. Other than that, it's similar coordinates, although this is what's known as a vector. So, this one means, because it's a positive 4, it means 4 to the right. And because it's a minus 1, it means 1 down. So if we pick a corner, this corner, and we move this corner 4 to the right and 1 down. So it goes 1, 2, 3, 4 to the right, and then 1 down. That corner is going to move there. Well, I can tell that the shape was, it's not going to change shape, it's not going to turn, it's not going to get bigger, it's not going to flip, it stays the same. So this end is going to stay as too high, the bottom is going to stay too long, the front of the shape is one up, and my shape there is going to be like that. So We've now moved it along. We can check the other corner as well. If we check the top here, this should have also moved the same amount. So one, two, three, four, and then down one. Yes, it moves in the right place there. So all the corners are going to be the same. We just pick one corner and you just check the shape space. Part B says so describe fully the transformation of the wraps, map C onto D. Well, you can see that this has been turned. Now, the important point here is that there are three marks available. So you've got to say three different things. So to get a single mark, you've got to say a rotation. Then you've got to tell me how many degrees. So it's either 90 degrees clockwise or 270 degrees anti-clockwise that will get you your second mark but to get to the third mark you need to tell me the center of rotation turning point and in this case you can see the turning points there because it's two by one 2 by 1. And if you span that round, that's going to be the same shape. So the center of rotation for the final mark, you've got to say is 0, 0, and that will get you a third mark. If you don't say all of those things, you can't get the maximum of 3. 